When I started out 100 by 100, it was just an idea. I was going to ask 100 artists to donate pieces of work for free. But I knew there were people out there for whom cancer had touched them in some way. And that began th this journey. And I'm so happy that tonight we're all coming together to have this beautiful presentation of a hundred tributes to all of you. It's wonderful to be able to be part of Art 100 by 100 and to be able to see so many other artists using their emotional journeys and emotional explorations to be able to express their, either their gratitude or their sorrow for people that they know that have got cancer. What strikes me really unique about Art 100 by 100 is that it's almost become a movement that started off as here in Muscat on a smaller scale has really become a global movement. <laughs> السرطان المعرض للمشاركة في هذا المشروع أعتقد أنها أعمال معظمها أعمال جيدة وكفوني أنا من ضمن لجنة التحكيم من ضمن لجنة الاختيار وفرز هذه الأعمال يعني أعتقد أنها تعطي أيضا أن المعرض يرقى مستوى جيد والأعمال التي لم يتم قبولها هي أعمال أيضا جيدة ولكن لا تتفق مع 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 ثيمة المعرض وبالتالي نشجع جميع الفنانين في في المراحل القادمة أن يقدموا يهبوا هذه الأعمال لمثل هذه الجمعيات اللي ممكن فنان يساهم في دعمها كمشروع إنساني. <تصفيق> The funds raised from last year's exhibition, we managed to pay for the insurance of our big initiatives, which is Dar al and the mobile mammography unit. My name is Mona Khasebi, I'm a jewelry designer. I mean, a long story with the cancer. It's a big part of my life. Uh, we started with cancer with my daughter, who is uh, surviving now from the river. I, uh, I lost my husband who survived uh, for uh, two years by uh, colon cancer, I mean, uh, advanced cancer. Uh, my name is Matti Silvia, I'm from Finland. I'm a painter from Finland, working in Turkey, Istanbul. When she found out that she has cancer, she didn't tell us, none of her children or the family. And then one day she says, I have to go to another city to be two weeks in the hospital. What's going on? Called to the hospital and said, What's going on? And we, doctor said, Your mother has cancer. Hasn't she told you? And no. It is emotional art. People who have donated their art, they are talking about their emotions, about people they know who have gone through this disease. And I hope that it will take the fear out of the public about this disease. Tonight, the walls of this museum are going to be adorned with paintings. But it's not really the art, because each one of them is a story about somebody's mother, a story of a best friend. And it is the celebration of their spirit which we are proud to present to all of you. Please, get your red stickers and make sure you go around and get there first. We, want, we don't want any of this art to 